Uh, but I also have to say what has also changed since election night uh, have been the chorus of voices from the President of the United States, uh, the junior senator of the state of Florida, and the governor of the state of Florida, a chorus calling uh, for the ending of the counting in this process. Uh, now, what is their excuse for that? Uh, the best I could tell, uh, I'm not sure. What I do know is that we don't just get the opportunity to stop uh, counting votes because we don't like the direction in which the vote tally is heading. Uh, that is not democratic and that certainly is not the American way. In America, uh, we count every vote regardless of what the outcome may be. Uh, I am replacing uh, my words of concession with an uncompromised and unapologetic call that we count every single vote. We count every vote. Uh, and I say this recognizing uh, that uh, my fate in this may or may not change, um, that the kind of violence and vitriol and um, uh, bullying uh, that we're seeing at some of these early uh, uh, precincts and these counting locations in Broward and in um, um, uh, Palm Beach County and in other parts of the state, uh, as these recounts commence, I would strongly urge uh, that we all demonstrate uh, the highest level of dignity and restraint. Uh, we can be for our candidates, we can be for our causes uh, result, without, in my opinion, resulting to um, moving toward any physical form of violence, uh, using heated uh, racist rhetoric, or seeking to divide our communities any further than how we have already been divided. Uh, I am prepared to accept whatever the outcome is of this election so long as every single vote uh, in this process is counted.